father and father, which is my grandfather and my great grandfather. From the fourth generation on my mother's side in Toowoomba. We just we had a place at Bitterson that was only small and we decided that we needed to expand so that we could supply only cattle from our farm through the butcher shop. And so we looked around and I had a friend that found this place and we went and had a look and it was what we were exactly what we were looking for because it had a bit of good cattle country with a hill and that for when it was wet and some really good cultivation for growing crops. So we went from sort of a couple hundred acres to 700 acres. Liam Gillespie is um, the neighbour across the road that does all the farm work for the property. It had been run down over a number of years and uh, people had bought it a couple of years before and it started to do a little bit of work. They re-fenced most of it but um, cultivation wise and that it, it was pretty run down it needed a lot of uh, needed a bit of care and attention I suppose. Yeah. Not long after we bought it we, we had the big flood and we found that um, the water course that runs through the place had been redirected down fence lines which meant it was trying to make water go at right angles and of course that was causing flooding and erosion. Yeah, my uh, son-in-law recommended Tim uh, just to have a look and see if he could give us some ideas. Uh, so we went to uh, had a chat with Tim. Tim got me all the maps and um, between uh, Liam and myself, Tim, uh, a couple of local farmers and we sort of got together and decided what we were going to do. So we got together with um, uh, an excavate operator and uh, a few ideas from Tim and a few ideas from the old, the old father that drove the uh, dozer and we got the maps and redirected the water to its original flow and made the, the water course wide so that the water spread out through the, through the, um, through the creek. Well, I wouldn't say we wouldn't have done the work, but mm. it certainly helped us fast forward it, if you put it that way. It got us going a lot quicker. I just helped, as I said, help speed it up because it, it's knowing where to start. And if you haven't got somewhere to start, it's pretty hard to get going. But once you find a starting point and you get a bit of professional help, well, it, it seems to fall into place a lot quicker. Yeah, pretty good. Yeah, we still have... Um, we, we haven't sort of finished what we're doing. The country got quite hard after the floods. Uh, so we're in the process of growing crops, laying plenty of stubble, maybe growing some legumes or some beans to, um, to soften the soil. Get as much help as you can get. Don't be afraid to take advice from, from uh, fellow farmers, from professionals like Tim. Then form your own opinion and, and um, go, go, go from there.